Okay, so we just got done with these pages, and we're going to be moving on to our next ones now. I uh, really like some of the stuff that was going on here, but I really like the big impact of this image. So let's see if we can get a little bit more cross-pollinization into one page of this and that. Uh, moving on with the next page. Alright, this page is completely done, so it goes in the done stack. This one flips over. <laughs> and we need a new page to go with it. Not a lot going on on this one. So, I don't know, kind of like that one. That actually goes really quite well with it. Okay, well, that was easy. Right on top. All right, so here's our two pages. Uh, I'm gonna do a little more with laying out the flow, and then I'm gonna go into the individual pages a bit more. Uh, let me just move something right quick. This right this second. So let me move that further up to get it kind of out of the way. Let's get it over as well. And this can go right there. Okay. So, I want to kind of follow a certain path where I do something like this. Roll over. I think we're going to do something like that. I kind of like that. That's a nice flow. And then from here we're going to go up into here. Follow a line going down. Maybe something big here. Kind of like some little squares here. like that. So there's my layout for the two pages. And what we're going into is we got these two pages and then one page it rolls into our next part of the story. So remember we're doing this in groups of six pages. Six, six, six all the way to 48. So we got eight groupings of six to get to our 48 pages. So, there we go. I'm uh, pretty happy with that layout. So let's move this over here so that we can still see it. But move this one into view so we can see everything going on with it. Okay, all right, so first page, let me get pencil, my pencil though. Sometimes pencils just disappear. Anyway, got the pencil, and I want to do something with the TV right here, where it's kind of, something kind of scary. But it's going to be old school TV. Right. Something like this. I don't know. Maybe something like that. And we're going to have. Got to have big dial. Changing the channels. Another big dial for the volume. 
<laughs> and then an on off button down here on off button and then yeah, there's another button for something for some reason I remember there being two buttons There we go. I'll have some scary dudes coming out. Breaking the edges coming out. coming out Yeah, these dudes are kind of scary, aren't they? Are they scary or are they silly? <laughs> Sometimes you just never know, man. I have to make them scary. Maybe this one has like a little crown. Okay, so now I got some scary dudes coming out of the TV. Yeah, needs a tone. There we go, and it goes over that arm.
kind of freaky. I need to I want to put down some some blacks here. That ain't the blacks I need. Here's, here we go. Yes. You're either on or off. On or off. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and let this dry for a second. and uh, So I can do some paint over the top of it. Alright, so just dried it real quick with the blow dryer. Just didn't want to get my hand in it and mush and ink around everywhere. Anyway, let's uh, do this where... Now Skits is going to look up at this like, ooh, what the heck is this? There you go. Gotta make the eyes a little wider. Cause he's looking at it like, oh my gosh, what is this? There we go. Stretch them out as wide as I can. This one here. Mm -hmm. Skits is looking at that going, I don't really like that. <laughs> And once I get everything kind of in place here, I'll uh, I'll spray fix it, and uh, that way uh, I can come back over it with the with the paint.
they coming from? They're coming from the TV. That's where they're coming from. <laughs> Do like a side profile of the TV and have like arms coming out. There you go. Have like a hand coming out. Rawr. Maybe have another one here. There we go. Got a couple of hands coming out there. Arr, arr. And Skits is going to get scared. So. Skits is going to fly off the page, kind of. Something like this. Just gonna rough this in. Like this. Something like that. Something like that. I have this arm coming up here like that. Yeah, that's kind of cool. <laughs> and then I want to kind of draw skits with like a big ah face on there so half real half fake you know
gets. Wants it to get out of there. There we go. Yeah, I'm liking this. This is going to be a cool page. There we go. So I got kind of like this, everything kind of coming right down to this point here. And then it'll fly right off the screen. Yeah, this is cool. Okay, so next thing I want to do is bring this one in and kind of continue on that look. Let me make sure I got the page completely on the screen here so y'all can see everything. Alright. Okay, so with this one I kind of want to do something different where that's Gets right here and we're going to be kind of looking down on skits. So I'm going to get the face kind of like that and then like this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap. The arms around him Okay, so that one goes like that. And then we'll have one shooting out from here. And then it goes straight down. And then wrap back around him. Like that. Just so I can remember what's over what here. And then and it comes back up. Like that. Okay, so that's one, two, three, wrap. And now I need one coming from the other direction. Zoom, zoom, zoom. I need one coming up through here, like that. <laughs> like that. Like that. Yeah. Like that. Like that. And then back around. And it's got a buckle up here. 
that'll be cool. That's cool and dynamic looking. So we got all of these arms and straps just going blah, 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 just ain't taking skits in here. like that and, and then we'll have uh, trying to think what um, following my initial design everything going this way um, <clears throat> So I want it to be kind of supernatural, psychic, you know, in the head type thing going on. So I'm thinking maybe, maybe we'll have some boots walking away. I think that's what we're going to do. We'll have a pair of boots. Pair of boots walking off, but really make them look like they're walking. Like that, where it's just the empty boots and they're walking off, kind of implying that Skits is about to walk off and disappear. So, yeah, that's what I'm, that's what I'm thinking. All right, so here's my rough sketching on these, and maybe maybe we can pull something in between here. Uh, maybe some text. If I do some text through here and coming in behind and then back around, that would be cool. Yeah, okay. I want to get... Uh, some photo reference of my face for these two faces. Uh, let me take those quick pics and then uh, we'll get right back to it. I got some photo reference here for some of the bits that I want photo reference on. Which I'm going to move this up a little bit. That way you can see a little bit better where I'm going to be drawing. I'm going to get this. It's gonna be cool right down here. Yeah, this is going to be cool. Mm. 
One of the things that I miss uh, when doing these videos is my ability to listen to music because I want to talk to you and stuff like that. That's why I got an earpiece in so I can actually listen to some music while I'm working. The um, music is a big part of all of my work. Always, always listening to music. So, just had to get some music on some music on There we go. It's kind of scary. <laughs> now that I'm really looking at this. Of course, there is something to be said about the quiet that you get uh, when you're actually working on this sort of stuff. It allows you to talk because you realize you're being quiet. Um, so, again, it's just to see how I go. It's just I always like listening to music. But sometimes you might not be able to listen to music, you know? That's just the way it is. So we'll just experiment with it and see what happens.
Yeah, I just wanted this uh, part to have you know, a more realistic look right down here because he's really scared. While some of the scary stuff is kind of cheesy and silly. <laughs> it's kind of scary, like, One thing that I really want to start looking at is uh, my push and pull in my images because I feel like it's kind of been lacking lately so I just want to make sure that I get a good push and pull with the uh, imagery. You know, between the positive and negative areas. So I'm really liking that now. Very nice. All right. Really like the way that turned out. If you like what you see in here, give us a like, share, subscribe. Also, go on over to the skitscomic.com website. All videos show up there a week before they ever hit YouTube. While you're there, pick you up a comic book, print, or go ahead and uh, get your original piece of art. Lastly, go over to indiegogo.com and sign up for the book that you're actually watching being made right now. Thank you and have a great day.